Hey guys, welcome to your general reading energy check-in for the collective. This is going to be from the 1st to the 15th, the first half of your month. So we're going to take a look at your overall energies, what's surrounding you guys, what you guys need to know, what you guys could expect for the first half of the month. And then we'll take a look at what the possible outcome and advice are. So this, this could be in anything. This could be in love, um, romance, relationships, friendships, family. Uh, career, finances, personal development, spiritual development. So we'll just see what the cards have to say, okay? Uh, before we get started, if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys could get up-to-date content that's being uploaded onto my channel. Um, give this video a thumbs up, like this video so that this message can circulate around to the individuals that need to hear this message. Um, and leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonated with you. Uh, those of you that are interested in booking a private personal reading with me, the link is in the description box below. All right, so let's get started here. Over energies for the collective for the first half of May from the 1st to 15th. What is surrounding the collective? What does the collective need to know? What can the collective expect? for the first half of May from the first to the 15th year. All right, we have the two of swords here on the bottom of the deck. Uh, eight, eight of cups. Uh, the Wheel of Fortune, Sagittarius, Pisces energy, Justice, Libra energy, the High Priestess here, Cancer, Pisces energy, the Three of Cups, and the Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. So I feel like in the past year, someone could have walked away from something, and I feel like something is coming back towards your way. This could be like a friend or something like that, or a family member. Like someone left, and now someone's coming back. Maybe they're coming to balance out the scales here. Maybe they're coming to tell you something, uh, a secret that's been kept uh, in for a very, very long time. Um, let's get some more messages just to see what's going on here. Tell me about the state of cups here. some cards that flipped over. But, all right. All right, let me shuffle this again. Hold on. Give me two shuffles. Right, let's try that again. Tell me about the Eight of Cups. Oh. All right, Six of Wands here with the Eight of Cups. Tell me about the wheel. Yeah, the Fool here, Aries energy, Aquarius energy, tell me about justice. Six of Pentacles, something is balancing out here. Something is coming back, so maybe someone's facing their karma. It's like someone left, but it was unsuccessful, and now someone or something is coming back around. Tell me about the High Priestess. You have justice again. So, collective, this is someone that you could be dealing with. Or this could be you. So place yourself where you see fit. Take it as it resonates. So someone's facing their karma here. I'm getting this energy of, like, what goes around comes around. 
Yeah, it seems like someone left and was unsuccessful and now they're coming back around to balance out the scales. But I'm feeling like maybe someone's not gonna play with this. Tell me about the Three of Cups. Yeah, it's a past love, I feel. It doesn't have to be love. It could be, you know, a family member or something like that or an old friend. Tell me about the Page of Wands. You have the moon here. So there was some sort of secret here. You have judgment. Someone's coming back for a second chance, collective. So like I said, this either could be you or the person that you're dealing with. So someone is facing their karma for leaving. It seems like they, there might have been a fight here or something like that. Maybe with a parent, someone older. It seems like maybe there was a parent involved and then there was a child and maybe the child left. I don't know. All right, so um, since it seems like there's someone else involved here, so we'll take a look at your person and then we'll end it with what the possible outcome and advice is. Um, Eight of Cups being clarified by the Six of Wands, the Fool being uh, clarifying the Wheel. Um, we have Justice being clarified by the Six of Pentacles, the Two of, um, no, the High Priestess being clarified by Justice. You know, this, these Justice card also could represent that someone here is waiting for some money or waiting for some sort of payout here. Someone might be coming back for money. Hmm. All right, um, Lovers, Three of Cups, Page of Wands, and then the Moon card. All right, let's see. Tell me about the person that Collective is dealing with here. What does the Collective need to know about this person? What are their current overall energies towards the Collective? Their true feelings and intentions towards the Collective here. For the first half of May, from the 1st to the 15th. Swords here. Justice again. All right. Empress, Libra, Taurus energy, Five of Cups, Knight of Swords, Gemini, Aquarius, Libra energy, Judgment again. Someone's definitely coming back. Someone's facing their karma here for leaving, I'm feeling. Or keeping secrets. Page of Pentacles, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus energy. Someone's definitely coming back. I feel like someone's coming back to heal the situation here. There, there, there was some sort of separation here. Like I said, this could be within the family. This could be with friends. This could be maybe a coworker. No, no, it's not. It's not work. Yeah, it's it's not. Justice here. Tell me about justice. I feel like someone regrets leaving someone. Yeah. Mm. Okay, so I'm feeling like someone might have left someone with a child. So this might resonate with some of you guys. Not all, but some. I feel like someone might have hid, hidden a child here or something like that. Yeah. Maybe with the lovers in the Three of Cups, maybe um, someone thought that this child belongs to like a third party or something like that. All right, tell me about the Justice card. Ten of Pentacles. So something is going on with the money here. I'm getting money. So I, like I said, I feel like someone's waiting for a payout. Um, 
Maybe there was a custody battle. Someone did take a kid, I feel. Tell me about the Empress. Someone's regretting it because this might hurt their chances here. I feel like the law is involved. You have the Two of Swords with the Empress. Tell me about the Five of Cups. You have the Hierophant here. Yeah, I definitely feel like there's like a divorce or a separation here. I don't know if someone was trying to avoid it. I don't know if someone was trying to protect their child because they didn't want to lose a child. Um, tell me about the uh, Knight of Swords. The Knight of Pentacles. Tell me about this uh, judgment. You have the Page of Wands again. So someone maybe realized they did something wrong here. Karma is biting them in the butt. And yeah, tell me about the Page of Pentacles. You have the Wheel of Fortune again. So we have the Justice card three times and the uh, Wheel of Fortune two times. So like I said, there's this energy of what goes around comes around. Yeah, look at that. Someone might be going to prison for doing something really, really, really bad. And I feel like it's this Empress. So I feel like there isn't, there, um, well, I think there was an Emperor here. Yeah. Someone is in battle with an Emperor. So I feel like this is the Emperor's energy, perhaps. And this is, yeah, so we have a pair here. Oof, this is really bad. Okay, we have Justice and the Ten of Pentacles, Empress, Two of Swords. Someone made a bad, bad decision here. Five of Cups being clarified by the Five of Pentacles. No, this is a Hierophant. Uh, Knight of Swords, Knight of Pentacles. Something. Someone acted impulsively. Someone was really methodical about playing this out. They're regretting it. I feel like maybe the law caught up to someone here. Yeah, um, Judgment, um, Page of Wands, Page of Pentacles, and the Wheel of Fortune. Maybe there are two kids involved here. Someone could be pregnant with a child with you. Okay. Uh, what is the outcome and advice here regarding uh, the situation here for the collective? All right, what does the collective need to know? What can the collective expect for the first half of May, from the 1st to 15th here? What does the collective need to know? All right, let's see what's going on. of pentacles on the bottom of the deck here four of wands queen of cups cancer pisces scorpio energy four of pentacles ace of cups the hermit virgo energy the devil here hmm. wow So someone here is definitely regretting something that they did. Someone hurt someone. Someone hurt themselves here. Uh, I'm feeling like perhaps I'm feeling these kings, these queens are like, you know, the, the uh, I feel like this queen is this uh, empress and the, these kings are this um, uh, emperor here. But let's get some more messages just to find out. But it seems as though Someone is about to face their demons here. Yeah, there. Uh, you have this four of pentacles here. Something is going on with mo with the money here for sure. All right. Tell me about the four of wands.
Tell me about the Four of Wands. Ace of Swords. Tell me about the Queen of Cups. Four of Pentacles again. So I'm getting this feminine energy has a lack here. Or that may, maybe there was a divorce and maybe this Queen of Pentacles was left with nothing. Or will be not left with nothing here. Tell me about the Four of Pentacles. Queen of Swords. Tell me about the um, Ace of Cups. Four of Cups. Tell me about the Hermit. Three of Swords. Um, I'm feeling someone hurt themselves because of their bad judgment here. Tell me about the Devil. The Tower. Someone might be was in this like very toxic energy of manipulating you know, everyone around them, perhaps, you know, lawyers, judge, people, friends, um, trying to make someone look bad, I feel. And now whatever has happened here, whatever this empress did, whatever this feminine energy did is catching up to them. They're trying to run from it or hide from it. Yeah, I feel like the law is catching up to someone here. Yeah, someone's about to face like major karmic justice and major justice for committing some sort of crime. I feel someone, someone, someone committed a crime here. Four of Wands, Ace of Swords, um, the Queen of Cups, Four of Pentacles. So No, if there was a third party, maybe this feminine energy took the children and went with someone else. That's a possibility. Because it seems like there's some truth that's being sought here in regards to why someone left, left with the children, or stole money, took money. Um, Queen of Swords, Four of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, Four of Cups. We have the Hermit, Three of Swords, the devil and the tower. So, um, collective, this was your general reading energy checking for the first half of May from the 1st to the 15th. If this resonated, please like, share, comment, and subscribe, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks.